गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी विल डू आर लेसन नंबर टू विच इज हैबिटेट एंड अडेप्टेशन वी विल स्टार्ट आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन दैट इज लॉन्ग क्वेश्चन आंसर्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन डिफाइन हैबिटेट एंड राइट द मेन फीचर्स ऑफ एनी टू हैबिटेट्स आंसर द एनवायरमेंट वेयर एन ऑर्गेनिज्म नेचुरली लिवस एंड रिप्रोड्यूस एग्जाम्पल हैबिटेट ऑफ फिश इज सॉल्ट वाटर fresh water the main features of two habitats are first forest forest habitats usually have a large number of plants and trees a variety of animals live in forests second desert desert habitats are sandy lands with less rainfall animals found in deserts are camel kangaroo rat etc a habitat is a natural home of any living organism students we go to a garden with numerous trees and plants do you think that's a forest well no forest actually means home of natural vegetation plants and animals students do you have ever seen deserts well deserts are land of least vegetation extreme temperature water scarcity and sand all over Question number 2 explain any three types of body coverings of animals with examples answer the various types of body coverings in animals are first feathers the body of birds is covered with feathers these help them to fly and keep their body warm example eagle parrot second scales body of reptiles are covered with scales example crocodile lizard snake third shell the hard covering protects the soft bodies of animals example turtle tortoise snail do you know what is a body covering a outer layer of body which protects the body is called body covering now students which body covering do we have yes we have skin similarly frogs have soft skin while polar bears have fur and insects have hard body coverings body coverings protect the body from damage and environmental conditions and also provides warmth question number 3 describe any three types of breathing organs in animals with examples answer different animals have different breathing organs suited to their habitats first body surface small microscopic organisms breathe through their body surface example amoeba second gills most aquatic animals like fish and prawn breathe with the help of gills third lungs animals like reptiles birds and animals take in air through nose which is carried to the lungs students do you know how do we breathe air enters in our body through nose which then goes to the lungs through windpipe inside lungs there are numerous blood vessels which absorbs oxygen from the air and then releases carbon dioxide outside similarly birds cats dogs breathe through lungs on land frog uses their lungs and in water frog uses their skin to breathe isn't it interesting students aquatic animals like fish have gills to breathe question number 4 write a note on how aquatic animals and insects move answer aquatic animals like fish move in water with fins and tails second seals and penguins move with flippers third frogs swim with the help of webbed feet fourth insects like butterflies and bees have wings to fly fifth spiders and ants move with legs hey students you all might have seen an ant moving what does help an ant to move yes a ant moves with the help of legs but what about penguins seals frogs and fishes how do they move Seals and penguins have flippers which help them to swim and move but frogs have webbed feet that is they have a piece of skin between toes which helps them to swim faster
क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव डिफाइन माइग्रेशन वाई डू एनिमल्स माइग्रेट एक्सप्लेन विद एग्जाम्पल्स आंसर मास मूवमेंट ऑफ एनिमल्स फ्रॉम वन प्लेस टू अनदर इन सर्च ऑफ फूड एंड वॉम इज कॉल्ड माइग्रेशन सम एनिमल्स माइग्रेट टू रिप्रोड्यूस एंड फाइंड फूड एग्जाम्पल्स मोनार्क बटरफ्लाईज माइग्रेट ड्यूरिंग विंटर फ्रॉम कैनडा टू मेक्सिको सैलमन फिश माइग्रेट फ्रॉम सीज टू रिवर्स टू ले देयर एग्स स्टूडेंट्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्टडेड अबाउट माइग्रेशन देयर कैन बी सेवरल फैक्टर्स विच रिजल्ट इन माइग्रेशन लाइक एस्केपिंग फ्रॉम हार्श एनवायरमेंटल कंडीशन इन सर्च ऑफ प्लेस फॉर लेइंग एग्स टू गेट सफिशेंट अमाउंट ऑफ फूड और टू एस्केप फ्रॉम देयर प्रिडेटर्स